Wasn't a, wasn't too bad other than it going up the nose, and I smelled uh, whatever that cream pie was for about a week or so. So I'll be wearing nose plugs this year if that happens. It was very successful last year, um, thirty-five thousand um, dollars that the team raised, which I think is absolutely fantastic. And if we can get um, even more kids excited and parents on board. Um, you know, the sky's the limit with what we could raise. Go Channel Cat! I feel like anyone can raise money. I mean, you don't have to raise like thousands of dollars. You can raise like ten dollars and that's, that's still pitching in and helping the team. The goal is 200, so we'll try to do that. Is it hard? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Tell me about it. You know, it's not really hard. You just keep going. How can you not recognize when kids are doing something that they never thought they would ever be able to do? And to see the look on their face when they accomplish that, I mean, there's nothing better. what the channel casts are at a swim meet I think that really shows how we are a family like we all get together at the swim meet we camp out together we support each other we swim we cheer for other swimmers it's not just about your kid it's about all the kids together um, and swimathon is a great way to come together and have a party supporting the team and just have a great time I would say bringing the money into the team, we are looking at possibly putting a dome over a pool if we could help doing that. We need scoreboards, we need um, printers, we need ley lines and blocks because they're all wearing out. So much bigger than just swimming. So when you donate, you help become part of something bigger in the sense that you're not just giving money to just kids to go swim laps, you're giving money to help give them an investment in their future.